Hi guys, I've been to Matalan. My name's Fawn and this is my channel and it's my happy place. I do a lot of shopping, guilty. Um, I like to bring it on here and show you guys and get your advice and um, basically just have a bit of a laugh. So if you like that kind of thing, please do give me a thumbs up, click subscribe and leave a comment. Oh, you'd think I'd be better at that, wouldn't you? Anyway, while I was recuperating, one of the days I went with my daughter to Matalan to get a whole load of bits and pieces for the kids. <laughs> As is the way with kids, they all seem to change sizes with their little pants and their socks and everything all at the same time, you know, the basic stuff. And we find Matalan a great place to go for that kind of thing. Less so for the boys. The boys are at an awkward age now. <laughs> they don't really fit the baby stuff, the cute stuff, but they're really a bit young for the sort of hip gangster stuff. But for Lara, we got loads. But while I was in there, I picked up a few things for myself. I haven't tried them. They've been in the bag now for two, maybe three weeks. <laughs> so we're gonna have a look together. So first up, I picked up a set of bras. I've never tried Matalan bras, but I thought these were pretty. It's a three pack, can you believe, for 16 pounds. They're just your very simple, very basic, underwired, no padding. I thought they were pretty shades of pink. It's two pinky ones and a white one. This one obviously is the fanciest one. The other ones are much more simple and much more, I suppose, what I wear really. But for £16, I thought it was worth a go. And a friend of mine had said, if you try cheaper bras, go up a size around the middle and go up a size in the cup because they tend to cut small. So I'm normally a 38E, <laughs> but I went to a 40F for these. So I'm hoping she was right. I must admit they do look very like the bras that I wear, but it's hard to tell, isn't it? I'll let you know. I'll come back to you. <laughs> Not in this video, but in a video. I will come back to you and tell you about the fit and about the comfort, but I mean, they looked all right. And what I liked was, you know, there are three snaps on the back of this. And normally on cheapy bras, they put two and it's a skinny little back strap, but this is a sensible back strap. So um, yeah, <laughs> you're gonna have to wait for the verdict on them, but they are pretty. I then picked up a pair of slip-ons. You know, I love a slip-on. I wear them all year round. They're like slippers for me, slip-ons. Um, I thought these were really cute. Can you see? I mean, they are as flat as flat can be. So not the best for backache and, and things like that. But I really liked the fact that it has this fake sort of, what would you call that? Pony print or something. Um, and They are actually leather uppers, which I thought was really, really nice. I did, very naughty, I slipped my foot into one in the, uh, in the shop to discover that they were very, very comfortable. Um, these were only eight pounds, which, you know, it's a bargain, isn't it? Eight pounds for, for a little pair of slides. But the great thing about it is, as I can always say, <laughs> you'll be bored of me saying it, with Bert in my life, spending a lot of money on this sort of shoe is a stupid thing to do because sooner or later he gets them it doesn't matter how hard I try he gets them so um I love them and I'd be very upset if he got them before I'd had a good wear of them but it is usually when they've become my favorite and they're really they must smell sweaty or something sweaty feet and it just attracts him so yeah I <laughs> I'm garbling away, aren't I? But I think these are great. Um, they are strapped together, which I hate them doing, but I'll bring it right in so you can see. As I say, very flat sole, but I do like the pattern on the top. I picked up for six pounds this little yellow blanket. It's one of these furry soft ones. It has the cutest little bumbly bees on it. I don't know if it'll work, but it, it's for, the, in my head, it's for the nature room. Now I'm home, the yellow is far more yellow than I thought it was going to be. I mean, it's lovely, don't get me wrong. I do really, really like it. But I'm not sure that the colour's right. I'm going to be offering this up to the paper. In the store, because it's one of these big sort of, um, almost like a factory building kind of stores, it was dimmer in the store and it looked slightly more um, ochre. 
whereas I would say this is a proper buttercup yellow so I don't think it's right for what I wanted it for but it was only six pounds and I thought I'd show you it anyway even though as I say I think it's going to have to go back I don't think the colour will work. I picked up a set of their false nails I've never had their false nails before um, they were down at the till. <laughs> these are Beauty Collective false nails, but I thought the colour was really pretty on these fake nails. Um, they were, oh, how, how much were they? Hang on. The colour's called Antique Rose and they are a square um, cut set. These are £2.99, which is a, you know, a fraction more than I normally pay, but I just thought they were cute and pretty and different. You're going to have to forgive the creases on these next things because they have, as I say, been in the bag for two to three weeks and they're very similar. And now I look at it, it's the same pattern, just a different colourway. But I like them because they were cotton and you know me. First up is a yellow dress. I thought this was really cute. It can be worn off the shoulder or up. Uh, elasticated waist. It's a midi length and it has a tear at the bottom. And look how pretty that pattern is. Yellow with the daisies. What I didn't realise in the store, as I say, was I bought exactly the same material, pattern, just a different colourway and this is a coloured set this is a pair of shorts they have pockets they look like they're a reasonable length again they're this nice cotton I love this colour blue nice oh, I didn't tell you how much that dress was oh guys I'm so sorry the dress was 18 pounds and I got it in a 20 sorry back to the shorts um, they've got an elasticated back with a flat front. What size did I get these in? I'm not entirely sure. I think I got a 20. Uh, no, I got them in an 18. Oh. Um, but I'm going to give them a whirl because they had the top that goes with, which I just thought was adorable, which I did get in a 20 to allow for my boobies. Again, it can go off the shoulder or on the shoulder. A uh, little puffy sleeve straight little body i mean it may look absolutely horrific on me but if i don't try i won't know and the color just mm, it got me so that was it for my prima uh, prima matalan haul uh the top was 12 pounds 50. so i'm going to quickly try these on this I, I mean there's literally what is there there's a cold outfit a dress and a pair of shoes but i will try them on for you so that you can see and so we can discuss <laughs> but i'd start with the one that i was most sort of dubious about gosh i love this color so much it really is oh i think it's one of my favorite colors but it doesn't work the set doesn't work the shorts are actually great i love that length they're really really modest in length i love the pockets they're nice and cottony and easy breezy i think it's the top that throws it off for me i feel like this should be longer or shaped in some there should be something it just feels like it's hanging on me i mean gosh it's so creased it's, it's awful of me really to be picky because it is so so creased but it's just not working you know and ironing it wouldn't change that um so yeah this cord set may be too babyish and maybe too i don't know i can't quite put my finger on it but i do feel a bit like a you know a little like I should be doing that and I'm not one of those girls um, I do have the sandals on and I'll show you those so there's the sandals they are really super comfortable super super comfy really soft I just checked the label I paid eight pounds um, and I think they were meant to be 14 pounds they were actually in the sale and I didn't realize but they will be great for stomping around the house you know getting my bits and pieces done kicking them on to pop down to, I don't know, feed the chickens or to, they're absolutely perfect and I am chuffed with the sandals. And here we go with the dress. Isn't that a lovely colour? I think that is such a pretty, pretty colour. It's an easy breezy, girls. It feels like I'm almost wearing nothing. Not sure if it's the most flattering thing I've ever had on. You'll have to let me know. Again, it can be worn off the shoulder me really if there's a bra strap look that one's twisted now oh i'm getting really clammy from trying all these different things on um i love the pattern i think the color is a ray of absolute sunshine but whether it's right for me i'm worthy of a place in my wardrobe where i've got some lovely things I'm not entirely sure so i'd like you to um 
kick back and let me know. So that was it for um, the Massillon haul because I spent a lot of money in there, guys. I have to say, I spent a lot of money in there. We had bags and bags of stuff, but it was aimed at the children. So I didn't really look at the ladies stuff very much. I will be going back, obviously, because I've got to take some things back. So there'll probably be another video coming soon where I've actually had a chance to walk around and properly go, hmm, would that work for me? Whereas these were more like, oh my goodness, look at that, and just thrown into the trolley because my focus was on the kids. Let me know about this one, you know? I'm really, there's something about it that makes me happy, which I think is probably the color in the pattern. I'm just not sure if it's flattering on me. Whether this yellow with my hair, not sure. <laughs> anyway, I hope you find some great bargains. And impulse buys, this time for me have not been great i don't think but sometimes it is that impulse buy that you think oh i'm never gonna like that you get it home you try it on and it's a revelation the blue shorts and top didn't work but equally it could have been amazing if it had, had a bit more fabric to it i think it was the length of the top that really stopped me from enjoying it but there we go i hope you're having a nice day here it's raining but clammy so I am melting as always. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Bye guys.